Hey guys and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Island Paradise. This is part two and now uh, we've got our sim here. Now I'm going to do something a little different than what I normally do in my expansion pack LPs. A lot of times in my expansion pack LPs I tend to make more than one sim. Uh, sometimes I'll make a couple. Uh, one time I think I've even made like three or four sims at one time. Yeah. But uh, this time I think we're just going to make one sim and uh, we're just going to see just what all we can do with her. Now, um, we are going to cover everything in this expansion pack, which there's a lot because, you know, you got the houseboats, you got the diving underwater, you got the resorts. And uh, so, you know, we're just we are going to cover it all in this LP. But, um, you know, I'd like to just kind of take my time and and, um, you know, just really go through. Uh, all the islands and stuff with you guys and just you know really just concentrate on one sim and just see how we do and now obviously you know she is eventually I think going to get married and and you know have her family and stuff but you know um, it's just kind of nice to just uh, concentrate on her um, you know just one sim for uh, you know for a little while anyway so anyway let me go ahead and introduce you to, to our sim here this is Adrian Spencer and uh, I've given her pretty much all clothes from Island Paradise, except for maybe just a couple of things. But anyway, here is her every day. Now, I just gave her just a regular necklace and bracelet and stuff. Those were not from Island Paradise, but the dress and the um, shoes are. Now, let me go ahead and tell you her backstory just a little bit. Those of you that are very familiar with my channel know that I'd like to have backstories for my Sims. Uh, I do really enjoy writing, and I, I really like coming up with a, a backstory for my, my characters here. Now, Adrian here, um, you know, she lived in a, a big city, and, uh, you know, she was like a high-profile um, journalist, you know, kind of person. And, uh, you know, she got pretty famous in her job, and uh, she was married to a, a, uh, a politician, and, uh, you know, who was, who was very famous. So they were actually a very, very um, successful, well-to-do couple kind of thing. And, um, but they had a, a secret, you know, because he, you know, he was very abusive to her, both physically and, and emotionally and, and all that. And um, one night, you know, he was, uh, had, had a little bit too much to drink and he, you know, came home and, and really whomped on her. And uh, so she fought back and um, uh, he had an accident and tripped and, uh, you know, hit his head and, and died, you know, in the, in the scuffle. So anyway, she got charged with his murder, but, uh, the, she got a good lawyer to, you know, get, uh, to get her off, obviously, you know, cause it was, uh, self-defense and it was an accident and all that, you know, and, uh, but it took all of her legal fees to get the, you know, to get out of the murder charge. And so she decided that it was just time to just, you know, move away from, well, we'll say Bridgeport, <laughs> that it was time to move away from Bridgeport, Bridgeport and you know just really go to a, an island um, like a tropical island place and you know she's always wanted to uh, she's always wanted to live in a place like that but you know due to their jobs and stuff they could they really couldn't and uh, so she just decided to pick it all up and you know because she didn't have any family or anything um, when you know during one of the fights or whatever um, she had a miscarriage and lost the baby that she was pregnant with and then, you know, obviously her husband died and she got off of the murder charge. So anyway, she just decided to pick up and move to Island Paradise. And um, uh, it. so right now, I mean, she doesn't have much money because, you know, her, the legal, um, the attorneys and stuff, you know, really took all of her money and stuff, you know, to, to be able to, um, you know, so that she could have her freedom and stuff. So, um, so she's just going to be on this in this island nation and she's just going to be exploring around and she's going to just you know get her hand into doing as many things as she possibly can so that is her backstory it's very very sad um but you know we're hoping that she can you know let's hope that she can find some happiness and she can actually have a, a nice life and stuff so anyway that is her backstory so anyway here's going to be her formal wear and again this is going to be another one from island paradise now it's going to take a little bit to load because i have a lot of content so just bear with me here Nushki Zanzi. Okay, so this is her formal wear. Again, it's Island Paradise, and I took, can't remember where the shoes came from, but yeah. Um, okay, so uh, next is going to be uh, sleepwear. Dag Dag. Okay, and this is from Master Suite, I believe. Master Suite stuff. Now, here is going to be her um, athletic wear. Salaba Wifa. Just kind of gave her this cute little pink outfit there. 
Uh, okay, so next is going to be uh, swimwear. Now, there actually came with a lot of swimwear from uh, Island Paradise, which I didn't so, show you guys. I did not show you guys all of that, but there's a lot of swimwear that did come with um, with Island Paradise, and a lot of it was like mermaid stuff and, and all that. Um, I can actually show this to you guys really quickly uh, since I didn't do that in part one, but uh, there's uh, there's one of them. I'll just kind of just go through this very quickly here kind of a different one right there and again we have um, all the different colors here and this I think is what I oops this is what I had her in but there it is in, in those colors right there okay and then here's some more there's a there's this just kind of like some shorts almost like a scuba uh, that's that's actually a scuba outfit, I think. Yeah. In fact, I think we're gonna we're gonna change up the we're actually gonna change up the uh, swimsuit that we had on her. We're gonna give her this the scuba outfit here, this scuba tank here, and I think maybe we'll go ahead and give her this one. I think that'll look nice. You know, she'll be able to kind of do some scuba diving a little bit. We can always give her another swimsuit if we wish to. But there's these other little scuba suits too that came with. Um, Seasons, I do believe. So anyway, we'll go ahead and give her that little scuba outfit right there. Very cool. So, and then uh, here is her outerwear. Pretty new Okay. Yep. So there's the outerwear. Just kind of picked out a full outfit for her, you know. Okay. So here's her personality. She's going to be an Aquarius. And uh, she's going to be handy. She loves to swim. And I think this is one of the new things that came with Island Paradise. Um, yeah, I, I believe so. It says, uh, these sims are like fish. Uh, these sims are like fish in the sea and gain a special joy being in the water. Okay, so that's the one of the new traits. Natural cook, we're going to have her be that. Neat. And then we're going to have her be a sailor, which is another trait that came with Island Paradise. And it says, sailors love the open sea and would much rather be on a boat than on land. Their aquatic experience means that they are better at catching fish. Uh, means that they are better at catching fish and are less likely to get seasick. Okay. Now, um, her lifetime wish is going to be a grand, ex a grand explorer, which means to own all uncharted islands. There are mysterious, and I'll just kind of, this is one of the new lifetime wishes that came with Island Paradise here. Uh, there are mysterious lands yet to be charted by any sim. To find them, your sim must set sail, uh, brave the high seas, and dive the deepest oceans. Search high and low for these uncharted islands and claim them as your own. Okay, so there is Adrian, and I went ahead and saved her to my, my bin, and um, I'm going to go ahead and upload her to the exchange so that you guys can play with her if you guys wish. So anyway, let's go ahead and get into the game here. And we're going dag, to dag. we're going to go ahead and find her a place to live. And um, what I want to do is get her a nice houseboat. And I think we should be able to do that in the beginning, um, in the beginning of um, of this. So um, just bear with me, you guys here, and we're going to see what we can find. Okay, guys, we're back now. What I think we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to go ahead and get her this one here called Happy Houseboat. Now there's two boats that you can actually get and several actual land houses that you can get, but we want to just give give her a nice little houseboat, I think, and we're going to go ahead and get it furnished, and so we'll go ahead and let her get moved in here. Uh, let's see. Now, the houseboat you're going to find on the uh, water, and um, I think you'll be able to... Uh, this music is so loud. This music is so loud, guys. Uh, okay, so... Uh, okay, it says, hello and welcome to The Sims 3. Okay, hold on guys, I gotta get rid of this tutorial, just a minute. Okay guys, so here we are again, yeah, um, since I had to reinstall it, it wanted me to do the whole tutorial and everything. Crazy, crazy craziness. So anyway, my goodness, but she's hungry, she's gotta pee, and um, yeah. But anyway, here's our little houseboat. Uh, it's, it's uh, you know, such a, as it is, it's not much or anything. But um, anyway, here is the all-in-one bathroom. So we're gonna go ahead and let her go into this the bathroom here. And um, we're gonna go ahead and use all-in-one bathroom. And, oh, let's go ahead and get the weather stone because I forgot about the weather stone. I, I'd like to kind of see where that, that comes up at. 
Um, let's go ahead and see where this weather stone is going to come up at. Woo! Over here. Holy cow. But yeah, there's there's our weather stone. And it looks like it's going to come up over here by the Paradise Pub. All right. So, but anyway, we're not going to worry about that. But what we want to do is, is we want to watch how this all-in-one bathroom works. You know, just because this is one of the new items in here. So, um, let's go ahead in here and um, we'll go ahead and watch her do this. Yeah, like we, we have to watch people pee, but you know. <laughs> so... So that, that doesn't take too long, but let's go ahead and get her, um, we'll go ahead and let her get a little something to eat, and then let's go ahead and uh, make some breakfast, and we're going to go ahead and make some waffles, and then we're going to actually just kind of go exploring around a little bit, and um, we probably should get a job because we don't really have that much money. Um, let's see, she wants to learn scuba diving skill. Okay, we can do that, and go snorkeling in the ocean, yes. Okay, so Adrian would love to uh, save some cash on the uh, on the sale happening at Costa Vista Corp. And okay, so the bookstore. Go to Map View. Okay, so yeah, um, very good. So a sale has just started at the bookstore. Blah blah blah. Attention, property owner. We'll go ahead and let her get something to eat here. And now we should actually get, um, I'd actually like to get a, even though she is a natural cook, we probably should get a, a fire alarm. Uh, we do need to get a burglar alarm. That is for sure. We don't have a whole lot of money. Now, I guess, um, if you want to, you can actually get a bigger houseboat when the, you know, when the time comes or build onto this one or whatever. And, but you can do that. I love the sound of this of the ocean. Really love it. Now I could actually go ahead and accept some gifts, which uh, which I probably should do. Uh, I usually do that in my LPs. I accept the gifts from a lot of people. So um, learn handiness skill. Take a class in the handiness skill. I don't know that we're going to take a class because we don't, we have a little bit of money, but I think we need to save some. Ah. Ooh. Yeah. Now, I don't know if Island Paradise came with any new recipes or not. I guess we will find out. So, she needs to go ahead and, and get something to eat. Let's go ahead and um, eat waffles. Okay. Now I'm going to go ahead and save this game, and then I'm going to go ahead and, and get the gifts, I think. So I'll be right back. Just bear with me here. Okay, guys, so we're back. Now we got the university mascot at our door, but we're not going to worry about that because we're just not going to worry about that because we're not going to university. <laughs> so anyway, um, we're going to go ahead and, and um, when uh, she gets done with her uh, waffles, we're going to have her go out to the mailbox and we'll get our gifts. I tried to load from the player profile and wall, but... Sometimes it gets stuck on me, and I don't understand why. So I like to try to get my gifts that way, but sometimes it just doesn't want to. It doesn't want to work. <laughs> so I have to do it this way. But um, now she wanted to learn uh, these skills, so we're gonna we're gonna try to we're gonna try to do that. Oh, I love the sound of that ocean. Love it. Oh, you be hoofla. Okay. So we're going to have her just go out to the mailbox and we'll get our, our gifts here. And obviously we're on a dock. Okay. So now i got a lot of gifts here. So we're going to see what we can take. Now um, I will go into buy mode and show you guys what uh, some of the stuff that actually came with um, Island Paradise. Uh, but anyway, let's go ahead and get to the gifts first here. Okay, so from Hairbrush Buddy 12 says, uh, love your videos. Keep them coming, please. Well, I most certainly will. Thank you very much. And we're getting a um, care package here. All right, so we've got a street art kit. So we're going to go ahead and um, we'll go ahead and send one back to you. Now, um, I can send my five today. So we're going to go ahead and take care of that. Let's go ahead and send back a surprise gift box to you. I'm going to say thanks for the uh, street art kit for my sim 
in my new Island Paradise LP. Um, hope this is good and and thank you for the lovely compliment. Okay, so go ahead and send a gift to you. All right. So next we have uh, Amanda Harder, 46, and we're getting a surprise gift box. I would, oh man, I would love to get a car. <laughs> uh, well, not a car, but we have a foot and handball. All right, so we're going to go ahead and send something back to you. We'll send you back a surprise gift box. And we're going to say, thanks for the handball for my sim in my new island paradise lp hope this is something good and useful for your sims enjoy now i don't know if any new social features came with island paradise they really didn't say anything on the on the live stream or anything so um i haven't seen anything so i think the social features and all that are going to be the same okay so from the lovable the the level the lovables the lovables hibby or level the lovable shibby okay <laughs> however you say that uh, okay it's a surprise gift box and the message from the game and we have 200 simoleons so thank you so much we can certainly use that we need all the money that we can get and let's go ahead and send back a surprise gift box for you <clears throat> and I'm gonna say thanks for the 200 simoleons for my sim in my new island paradise LP. Hope this is good and useful for your sims. Enjoy. Okay. So, get some stuff sent back here. <clears throat> From the lovable Shibby again, and we're getting a care package. Okay. And it looks like we got a whiteboard and a, um, a podium, which came with University Life. Now, I'm not going to send one back because I already sent you one, and I want to spread the wealth a little bit. Okay, so from SimmerFreak44, uh, how excited are you for Island Paradise? I'm stoked, and we'll be uh, adopting a pet for the Let's Play. Cool. We'll go ahead and send something back here. Uh Okay, it looks like we've got, um, okay, so we got a care package and we've got a bookshelf. Okay, very nice. So she can learn handiness skill from her books, which is good. Okay, so we're going to send back a surprise gift box to you. Um, okay. So thanks for the bookshelf for my sim in my new island paradise. And I gotta capitalize the T. LP. Very excited for Island Paradise. I'm just gonna put IP. It looks beautiful. Enjoy. All right. Okay, so from SimmerFreak44, uh, what is the first thing you will be doing when you get Island Paradise? Uh, scuba diving or finding mermaids? I can't wait to see your Sims. Awesome. Well, I don't know. I mean, it's, you know, she wants to go scuba diving, so we, we got to dive to actually find mermaids, I think. So we do have to, we do have to do that. But I uh, will go ahead and take the... Uh, the uh, surprise gift box. It looks like we got a couch. Now I'm not going to send one back because I've sent one back to you and I kind of want to spread the wealth a little bit. But yeah. Um, okay, so from SimmerFreak44. Hey there, Sweet Nightingale. Will Amy and Joe make a return anytime soon? I miss them. Yes, they will. Amy and Joe are from my Generations LP, which yes, they will be making a return. It's just they were kind of on the back burner with trying to get some of this other stuff going on. But yes, they will be making a return. I promise. <laughs> All right, so it's a... Uh, um, a elixir and we have a vial of enlightenment now I'm not going to send one back because I've sent one back to you already okay so from Kimmy ah 80 and we're getting a supernatural elixir and it looks like we've gotten the opposite personality thank you very much all right so we'll go ahead and send something back to you and let's go ahead and send back a um, we'll go ahead and send back a supernatural elixir back to you since you sent one to me um, Thanks 
for the opposite personality elixir for my sim in my new island paradise LP. Hope this elixir will come in handy. Enjoy. All right. So there we go. All right. So next we have Kimmy Aw 80 and we're getting a care package. And it looks like we have a uh, sketchbook. So that came with University Life. Now I'm not going to send one back because I want to spread the wealth a little bit from uh, LJJW says uh, give this to whoever. All right, so let's see what we have. It's a care package and we have a vinyl stereo. Very nice. And I can't send anything back because I'm at my five. So I wish I could, but I can't. From LJJW with the care package. Hi, Sweet Nightingale. Um, I know that IP is soon. Um, I'm, I'm <clears throat> assuming... Uh, you are LPing it, then that is for them uh, with much love from a sub. Okay, very nice. Thank you so much. And it's a care package. And it looks like we have a lamp. So very nice. Very, very nice. Thank you so much from Michael66169. And it looks like a uh, care package again. Okay, and it looks like we have, um, all right, so we have a sofa. We have another couch. I really shouldn't be doing this at 4 a.m., guys, let me tell you, but I want to get, I, I got first episode up, and now I'm trying to get the second episode up, um, so yeah, I'm really trying to scramble to get, you know, to, to get this in here. Uh, okay, so from Demetzler, uh, hope it's good, money, car, maybe? Well, let's see what we have here. <laughs> well, not money or a car, but we have a modern orchid, so thank you so much. It was a surprise gift box from Managa Love. And we're getting a um, care package. Looks like we have a stereo. Very nice. Thank you so much. Really do appreciate that. From ABC Girl 125. Uh, okay, and looks, looks like a surprise gift box. And we have a Sleeping Gnome McNulty. Very nice. Thank you so much. From Cooley9876. Love your LP. Keep up the good work. Well, thank you so much. And we're getting an elixir. Really do appreciate it. We are getting lean and mean. Very nice. Very, very nice. All right. Uh, so from Fiboy1029, and we're getting a uh, surprise gift box. That looks like we have a bed, the emo cot. Thank you so much. Very, very much for that. From Spellcaster Jr. says, for any LP of your choosing, enjoy. And we have an elixir. We have a vial of potent bliss. Very nice. So she'll be able to get her fun level up very quickly. Spellcaster Jr. says, hope this is useful for your Sims. Enjoy. And it's a surprise gift box. And I'd say very useful. 300 simoleons. We can always, always use that. So thank you so much. From Sims to a Holic, 63. Hi, Sweet Nightingale. Here's another gift for your Dragon Valley LP. Uh, I hope you're having a really good day, week. All right. Well, thank you so much. So we're going to save that for Dragon Valley. A Team Chris. And we're getting a uh, surprise gift box here. And it looks like we have the fern. Very nice. The fern. <laughs> From Gaps1. Uh, all five coming your way. Well, thank you so much. And it's a care package, it looks like. And we have uh, a street art kit. Very nice. Can always use one of those. From Gaps1. And we're getting a care package. And it looks like we have a TV. Very cool. We might be able to change out that cheapy one for this one here from Gaps One with an elixir. And it looks like we're getting a jar of friendship. Very nice. That will come in handy from Gaps One. And it's a surprise gift box. And uh, we have, uh, oh, we have a computer. Very cool. We can always use that. Absolutely. Gaps One, love your vids. Don't stop if that's the only thing that keeps. Uh, me going at work. Oh, well, thank you so much. I really do appreciate that. That's, you know, what a lovely compliment. Thank you so much. And this is a care package. And uh, my goodness, we have another computer. Very nice. We have a laptop this time from Zruggy123. Here's a gift for your Midnight Sun Challenge, and I hope it helps you complete the challenge. All right, so we're going to go ahead and save that for uh, Lynette and Yves for Midnight Sun. ABC Girl 125 and we're getting a surprise gift box here and we have uh we have a sunflower vase okay very nice we have some little decorations from sims to a holic 63 
Uh, here's another gift for your Dragon Valley LP. Okay, so we're going to save that for Dragon Valley. And from Tara Lee Gray Jr. says, Happy first day of summer. Well, same to you. Happy first day of summer to you. And we've got a care package. And it looks like we have, um, uh, we have a bookshelf. Okay, very nice. So we'll go ahead and save the rest of these gifts for the other LPs that we're supposed to be doing. Now, um, all right, so we're going to go ahead and, and uh, we'll have her go back in here. Now, she's on the she's on the horn. Now, I would like to, she wanted to go scuba diving, so we actually need to go to one of these dive lots if we can find one here. Rocky Reef. All right, let's, let's go here. Um, scuba dive. Uh, let's see. This area is too dangerous to dive in. Try increasing scuba diving skill first. Okay, I'm not sure how to do that. Um, I guess we can actually go into the water and, and try to do it here. Can we... Okay, let's go ahead and snorkel, I guess, and see what happens here. Because we haven't seen the snorkel. We'll go ahead and have her just snorkel. She's going to go ahead and get into her, her swim gear, I think. There we go. All right, so she's got to swim out here first. Go ahead and speed two through that. All right, so... We need to kind of follow her just a little bit here. All right, can we do anything here? Uh, play in sand. Um, yeah, we need to find somewhere to, to go uh, to go diving here. Let's see. Um, I would. Yeah, we got to find somewhere to go diving that's not too dangerous. Um, can we do anything here? Oh, we can go windsurfing here. Let's go ahead and have her do that. I think she's probably got to got to bring her boat all the way out here, but we can we can at least do that. Oh, there she goes in the speedboat. Okay, so she's got a little speedboat that she's going to go in. How cool is that? Oh my gosh. How awesome is that? This is awesome, guys. This is really really cool. <laughs> this is awesome. All right, so she's going to go ahead and windsurf here. So we'll get a close-up so that we can kind of see this a little bit. We'll just kind of see what she wants to do here. Uh, visit a graveyard during a full moon. Girlfriend, you're a little crazy. Listen to the, listen to that ocean. Now, I, I want to find us a, a dive lot that's, that's not going to be too dangerous. Um, I'm not sure how to, we got to figure out how to increase our uh, scuba diving here. Um, we could actually go to the pool over here and uh, see what that's going to be like. kind of follow her while she goes over there and I love the little speed boats I love them <laughs> how awesome is this how awesome is this guys so she's gonna pull that up here and then we'll just see see what this looks like as she goes up to this little path here and she has to jump in the taxi Uh, clean something. Okay. All right. Look at those flowers. Look at that. So she could actually go swim in here. Look at that. Okay, let's go ahead and snorkel. Oh. 
So here's here's uh, some people that we could talk to. But look at this. Look at the the pool and the diving board. And I I really like the shape of this pool, guys. I really like this a lot. This is very very nifty. Absolutely nifty. <laughs> she kind of looks a little funny in the um she kind of looks a little funny you know in the um in the water with the with the scuba thing here be splashed such a beautiful day in the islands guys i'll tell you <laughs> this. Woo! This is awesome. <laughs> Alright, so let's see where else that we could go to maybe. Um, I just, I I'm trying to just kind of explore the town just a little bit here, guys, because, uh, you know, this is going to be kind of awesome. Um, uh, let's see. Yeah, this is going to be awesome. Okay, let's visit the dive spot. Let's see if there's anything that we can do. All right, so. Which means that she's going to have to take a taxi and then uh, take the boat out there, I think. But we can at least... Try to visit the, the spot and then see if there's anything that we can do. Yep. See if there's anything that we can do here. So into the taxi. And into the boat. <laughs> How cool is this? Oh my gosh, this is neat. This is cool, guys. This is so awesome. I'm loving this a lot. Uh, buy a windsurfing board. Okay, we can try to do that. Get a little bit of money. Not much. Alright. We'll put that on speed two till she gets out there. And it takes a little bit to, to get out there. Okay. So let's see if there's anything that she can do here. Um, Try increasing the scuba dive skill first here. Um, well, let's let's snorkel, I guess. I'm not sure what we can do with this flag. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to figure out how to increase the scuba diving skill. I guess maybe when you snorkel. Alright, she should be getting a skill in something kind of soon here. Put that on speed three until... Oh gosh, and it's raining! Well, we can't, we can't do anything here now. We're gonna have to go home. Yep, it's way too dangerous to be out here now with, with it raining. All right. Yep. Get on the get on the boat. Well, at least we got a bookshelf that we can actually um, put up, and we can actually uh, read something. And we'll put up our computer, and maybe we'll do something on it until it quits raining here. <laughs> but she's having a blast, and she's sailing. And that's a new moodlet. It says, uh, Sims with the Sailor Trait love being out on the water from boating. Okay, very nice. All 
All right, so we're going to go ahead and go back into the, the, the houseboat here. Now, I'm going to go ahead and put up our, um, <clears throat> I think I need to go ahead and get a burglar alarm, and then I'm going to go ahead and put up our, um, our uh, bookshelves and stuff. So just give me a minute, guys, and I'm going to go ahead and get this going here. Okay, guys, uh, we're back. Now, um, I went ahead and changed out a few things. Um, I put in, I, I got her a multi-tab. Um, we, had, we had some money to be able to do that. And I switched out the one cheapy bed with the one that we got as a gift in the family inventory. I changed out the, um, I changed out the uh, fridge and stove and got something a little better. Uh, Adrienne is a natural cook, so blah, blah, blah. Now she's going to go ahead and make some mac and cheese. I did not have room to put her bookshelf in there. And oh my goodness, it's a good thing that we came back home because it is hailing now. But um, we didn't have room for the bookcase, so we got to leave that in the inventory right now. Um, <clears throat> maybe we can get something a little bigger later on, but, you know, uh, we could always read something on the multi-tab or something, you know. But, uh, yeah, so, um, and I put the computer on her desk, and I put the laptop in her inventory. Um, changed out the bed, like I said, with the one that we got as a gift. Uh, got a burglar alarm. So, yeah, we're, we're sitting pretty good now. Um, and I, I went ahead and, um, I went ahead and uh, took out some stuff that um, was in the uh, mm -hmm. family inventory and, mm -hmm. um, and sold that. You know, got rid of just a couple of things that we really didn't need and, and so forth. So, yeah. Um, now she's listening to Handiness on the multi-tab. So, um, we got two skills. Uh, okay, jump in the frying pan, mm. common household objects. Mm. So, she's doing good there with the Handiness thing. Uh, find an object while snorkeling. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and have her just get something to eat and then we'll put away the food. So go ahead and uh, go ahead and grab a bowl. Alright, and then we'll go ahead and put this into the fridge for her. And when she gets done, we'll go ahead and it's normal quality. We'll go ahead and have her clean it up. <laughs> And then we'll go ahead and have her use her all-in-one bathroom. And then we're going to go ahead and have her go to bed because she's getting pretty tired. So, uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and use all-in-one bathroom. She's going to go ahead and clean that up. She could tinker with it and upgrade it or whatever, but yep, yeah, so. And she's getting tired, so we're going to just have her go to the bathroom. We'll go ahead and have her go to bed, and we'll see what tomorrow brings for um, maybe the weather will be a little better. Let's go ahead and have her go to sleep. And uh, I'll be back in the morning when she wakes up, and then we'll see what we can do for the next day. So I'll see you then. Okay, guys, so Adrian is getting up, and it looks like we have a festival coming to Island Paradise. So she's going to make her bed. Now, we're going to have her listen to a writing skill, because I think we could have her write some books and stuff. And, uh, yep, the summer festival, blah, blah, blah. And, uh, yeah, we could have her write some books and stuff, and then, um, you know, she can earn a little bit of money that way. But uh, we're going to have her do that, and then we're going to have her make some pancakes, because she's getting a little hungry. Uh, you know, it's about halfway down the green. And uh, yeah, we could actually do some snorkeling and see if we can find anything else. Get that scuba diving skill up and so forth. I guess if you snorkel enough, you can you can do that. Okay. Uh, okay, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, ignore the call. We have an opportunity. It says, enter dish at the restaurant. Okay, before time runs out, we can do that. Yeah, we can do that. Okay, owner resort. Well, we're eventually going to do that. We're eventually going to do that. Oh. 
You can do it. You're a natural cook. You can do it. Alright, so we got cooking skill to level 2. You go ahead and grab yourself a plate. And then we're going to go ahead and put this away. My goodness. Yeah, we'll go ahead and put that away. And we got, what did we get now? We got uh, cooking to level 2. We got uh, writing skill. Very nice. Mm. All right. Mm. So you go ahead and eat that, and we're gonna we're gonna snorkel. Go ahead and clean it up, and you know what? Let's come out here and snorkel. Snorkel out here. Okay, and she wants to join writer career. Guess we can do that. Find an object while snorkeling by a windsurfing board. Learn scuba diving skill and own a resort. Alright, go ahead and snorkel. We need, we still need to snorkel. Snorkel. And snorkel. And we're going to come out over here and, uh, whoops. And go ahead and, uh, Do that. Come out over here. We're going to snorkel. And we're going to snorkel some more. I guess maybe we need to go out into, into the ocean to do that. I'm not sure. I am not sure. Oh, purchase a vehicle. Hmm. Well, got a paddle boat, aqua sled. We could get an aqua sled. That'd be kind of nice. All right. So let's go ahead and come out here. And let's see if there's any place else that we can snorkel. Oh, look at what we got here. Well, we don't want to fish. Let's come out here into the ocean and see if we can snorkel some more here. Go ahead and snorkel some more. Which means we'll have to get... means we're going to have to swim out here. Alright, this is going to take us a little bit. Alright. So if we can get a skill up, you know, then we're going to be good. It's a little difficult to get a skill up, though. So we're still doing, still doing this route here. Okay, what do we got here? Okay, so Adrian is ready to begin her uh, underwater adventure, exploring the the deep depths of the ocean floor. Okay, so she can continue uh, building on the skill by snorkeling or scuba diving. All right, so we can go scuba diving, guys. We can go scuba diving. All right, so she just earned enough lifetime happiness points to get something. So we're actually going to go over here. Now, um, 
Okay, here's one of our dive spots. So we could actually, oh, neighborhood pet adoption. Don't wanna do that. All right, so we can go ahead. Oh, it's too, still too dangerous. All right. Okay, so she's still doing pretty good with that. So still got to get her her skill up, but you know, let's let's go ahead and go on back home, and I think we're gonna go ahead and, and see if we can cook whatever we need to cook, and then we'll enter. Um, we'll go ahead and enter. Um, oh, we're losing her here. We'll go ahead and enter our um, dish for our cooking contest. So here is her aqua sled. Now, um, she was riding a little speedboat whenever we um, whenever uh, before we got the aqua sled, but yeah, but now that she's got that, she's gonna go ahead and ride it. So anyway, let's go ahead and have her just cook up a little something and then we can enter enter the dish. Let's go ahead and serve up some lunch and she can go ahead and serve up some, oh, how about some grilled cheese? And then she can go ahead and take them to the, she can take them to the restaurant and um, we can enter our dish. Haha, mm, mm, ah. <laughs> don't cut yourself. All right. One did one serving of any recipe. Okay. All right. Go ahead and cook that. Ah, crazy thing. All right. So there it is. All right. So we're going to go ahead and put this into her inventory and we should be able to go and enter that contest so we're going to do that and then all right so let's go ahead and um enter that uh okay so mm -hmm. certain mm -hmm. items in your inventory will will go bad over time yes we know that all right all right so off into the taxi we get and we'll be able to see what this rabbit hole looks like for the restaurant so everything is like on docks here you know everything is just all on a dock so this is what this is what it looks like it's a big it's a big uh restaurant and it looks like it's a we got a day spa we got a we got a restaurant we got a um we could become a partner <laughs> for 200 simoleons uh enter dish well we could we could become a partner That'll give us a little bit of money. Uh, buy a dryer. I don't think we're going to do that right now. Buy a washing machine. I don't think so. Uh, go snorkeling in the ocean. Okay. Visit France. Well, we're not going to do that right now. <laughs> we got to stay here on the island for a little bit. So she's going to go ahead and do that and we'll see what we get. We got bills to pay too. All right. So congratulations, your food uh, earned, earned the uh, palate of the judges and swept all the other contestants aside. Uh, okay, you've earned this cash. You've earned this cash prize. All right. Very nice. So we're gonna go ahead and become a partner for two hundred simoleons and then we'll we'll be able to get some money for that which is good very very nice and now we should actually go back over here and uh, we're probably going to have to pay our bills because yeah i do believe that we're going to have bills to pay all right so we'll have to read what that says in just a minute Okay, so we got to pay bills for 164 simoleons. Congratulations, Adrian is now a partner of Trade West Spa and Bistro. Okay, she is now entitled to a share of the profits, which she can pick up weekly. Okay, um, of course, if she bought the, she bought all the other partners, she would get uh, even more money, and yep, she'd get even more money and have additional uh, control over the place. But we don't have enough money to be able to do that right now, so. You know we're gonna have to um, we're, we're gonna have to make sure that we uh, 
Yeah, we don't have enough, enough money to do that right now. So we'll go ahead and pay the bills. And then that way that's all done. Uh, she's having a blast and uh, and she's fulfilled. Okay. And she's going to have to pee again and stuff here. So we're going to go back to the all-in-one bathroom. You can go ahead and do that. Go ahead and use all-in-one bathroom. And then we're going to go ahead and listen to some more handiness. Go ahead and listen to Tabcast. And it's going to be some handiness. And then you know what we're going we're gonna to have you start a book. We might as well just go ahead and have you start a book as long as we're here. So let's go writing. And we're going to start a sci-fi novel. We should actually have you join the writer career. All right, so we'll call this, uh, how about, uh, Lost on the Islands, I guess. <laughs> Why not? All right, guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. We've been going on for a little bit. Uh, we'll see if we can do some, we'll see if we can uh, up the scuba diving skill a little bit more and, and actually try to go under the water next time. And uh, yeah, we'll just, we'll see what, we'll see what we can do. So um, you guys have a fantastic day. Uh, favorite and like this video, leave a comment and tell me what you think. Uh, I really hope you're going to like this series. I'm, I'm really going to enjoy doing this LP, I think. I really am. Uh, you know, because this Island Paradise is so different. So, uh, yeah, hit the heck out of the like button. Uh, leave a comment, as I said. Subscribe to see more of the series. Post into the other series I do that you're interested in. Uh, okay, so we got uh, writing to level two. Very nice. Or handiness to level two. Very nice. Um, you guys have a fantastic day, and we'll talk to you guys all later. Bye, guys.